Hello, welcome to a new Scene Anatomy video. Today I want to check out another cheap contact library with an interesting concept. Today it's time for Ultimate Pet Bundle by Rigid Audio. I decided to buy this because for $599 I think it could be a very interesting library. So what you get here is quite impressive. First of all you received here the Pet Station 1 which comes with two times 200 um, sounds and it's a rompler so it features 2.2 gigabyte of sounds and it comes all with a cool designed interface and so it has different features and more. Pet Station 2 has even more sounds so you get 5 gigabyte of sounds, 400 samples and includes also the sounds from Pet Station 1 so you get 3 gigabytes of new sounds for a price of 599 uh, 5 $99, what is about, I think, 5 euro. So it's a great value. So 5 gigabyte for 5 euro, it's a great deal. And you get in the new GUI also here a randomization feature, what is interesting for instant new sounds. So to give you now a better overview of these libraries, I jump now in Ableton Live. I'm now here in the Ableton Live in the contact5 sampler and it must know here that this library doesn't work with contact5 player so it only works with the full version of contact5 and as you can see here it's the interface you have two different layers layer A and layer B and each layer has here 200 different sounds so this coming from synthesizers, field recordings and more and uh, they range from vocals uh, pet sounds and more and all this you can create big big uh, pet sounds perfect for ambient and more and so you can combine two sounds here then you have here a volume a pen an auto pen and a tune and this is also for the same for layer b and here you have also a variation the variation change the parameters um, with a preset so you see so you get different uh, sounds of it and what is cool then there is also some rhythmic stuff then in the variation inside where you get instant variation, um, rhythmic variation of your sounds then you have here also an envelope a cutoff a filter envelope so you can add uh, this envelope also to a filter envelope then you have also here a step filter for rhythmic stuff a distortion phaser flanger and a reverb or a convolution reverb with different convolutions here from the developer. So we range here from granular style, arena, um, piano, different spaces, a spring reverb and more. And you can also change here the way how to work with the mod wheel. So you activate here the low pass filter, high pass filter or vibrato. So to give you an overview how pad station sounds, I give you now some sounds which are created uh, these sounds are not included in this library, but it's quite easy to recreate them. So, let's start.
As you maybe heard now, pet station can create very big sounds, especially pet sounds or soundscapes and more. And uh, with this possibility to crossfade two different sounds, it gives you near unlimited possibilities because you can take one sound and take the second one or maybe take one the zero one here the pet station and take here another one and make so near unlimited possibilities here to combine sounds and on top don't forget if you have contact 5 you can add different uh, you can make a multi instrument so you can make a patch with 10 different sounds per example what is impressive so for pet station 1 it's a very interesting instrument, especially for ambient sounds. Let's check out also Pet Station 2, which goes in the same direction, but adds more sounds. I'm now here in Pet Station 2, and as you can see, the interface is the same. You have here the two layers, here the crossfade, you have here the envelopes, the pan, auto pan, tune, and effects. And what is here new is you have here randomization, so you can put a uh, random, so you randomize here the different sounds. And what I maybe criticize here a bit is that the uh, presets or the sounds doesn't have names. So it has only pet 1, pet 2, pet 3. So I prefer the sound names of the pet station 1, where you get maybe a better overview how they sound. And um, compared to the first version, it has here now 400 uh, sounds. And that's a lot to play around. So you had a lot of more possibilities here. And as I said, if you try everything, I think you will play hours and hours with it. And um, let's check also maybe of these sounds here. Let's hear pets. Let's check here maybe pet 14. Maybe 25. Maybe 55. As you hear, it's uh, a very, very bright, uh, large combination of different sounds here included. So they range from very bright to dark sounds, noisy stuff, vocal stuff. So there are a lot of different sounds included. Maybe check out here something that goes 150. That's more a pet sound. So there are a lot of uh, pet sounds already included. Let's take maybe here 200. So here you get a very interesting, a versatile um, combination of different sounds here. You have dark sounds and here pet 200 is a very dark sound noisy so it's a very interesting rompler here with cool sounds to give you now a bit more sounds i created again some uh, presets of it uh, so i take two different sounds and created some uh, some presets with this content and also these sounds are not included in the library but it's quite cool to create them because you have here the randomization and so you get very instant new sounds here.
2012 to buy a library of $599 from Rigid Audio? I say yes. The Ultimate Pad Bundle is a great library for ambient, for atmospheric musicians who love to create these kind of sounds. And for me it's also a no-brainer for every Contact 5 user, because you get here 5GB of sounds, and on top these sounds are not locked inside Contact, but they come also in WAV files, so you get 5GB of samples with atmospheric sounds, which can be also used in any other sampler. So Pad Station 1 and Pad Station 2 is, in my opinion, a fantastic library which, uh, with a very low price. And to be honest, also one of the best libraries I played ever for such a price. And this price is available a bit longer because I see it already some months ago. So if you are a user of Contact 5, don't miss this library from Rigid Audio. So I hope you enjoyed this new video. Please let me know what do you think about the Ultimate Pet Bundle. Are you interested in such libraries? Do you use them? Or uh, do you prefer more um, normal synthesizers and other stuff? So it would be cool to discuss with you. And as usual, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a positive thumb and a subscription for more future videos. Big thanks for watching and don't forget to join the Patreon page for exclusive sound content and regular um, giveaways for Patreon users only. Big thanks for watching and I hope to see you again very soon in our next videos. Bye!